Hi, this is Dr. Naeem, your favorite OBGYN. Today I'm going to talk about ovarian cysts, which is very common. Uh, a lot of my patients come to for evaluation for pain or just for a general checkup, and we find uh, um, an ultrasound. Uh, and they're usually worried that maybe it's cancer or what they should do. Usually, uh, on a younger woman, the chance of being uh, cancer is very low. Uh, of course, we check the size and uh, component of uh, what's inside the cyst. Uh, most of them, there are uh, uh, ovulatory cyst that means the cyst that is formed uh, when they rupture and the eggs comes out uh, so they have uh, they have a lot of them have them in the ovaries uh, so usually uh, nothing to worry about if you see cyst uh, especially if it's less than five centimeter and if it's uh, just water in it like a, a water cyst uh, they're usually benign uh, it could be sometimes blood in them uh, like a hemorrhagic cyst they have some solid parts that makes it more worrisome if it's fluid around the cyst it also makes it more worrisome uh, if somebody is older, there is more concern, if, especially in somebody menopausal, uh, is more concerned, they have to have surgically remove them. There are certain markers to check for uh, cancer, uh, such as over one or CA125. Uh, we do them on older women in general, uh, sometimes also on younger women, if, depending on the situation, uh, that uh, almost 90% to 95% rules out to be a malignant or cancerous uh, uh, tumor or a cyst. Uh, so that's a good marker to check. Uh, but again, depending on the size, component, free fluid or not around it, we might opt for surgery or uh, just uh, observation of the cyst.